So this is actually pretty dense and heavy for its size. Ooh. And if you look at it, it does look like it's kind of melted and misshapen and reformed. So we're thinking it could, could possibly be a... <laughs> yeah, we've been known to take the wrong one on many occasions. Japan contains forgotten history. Japan Treasure Hunters is on the path to find it. On this episode of Japan Treasure Hunters, the team travels back to the mountains of Guma near the site of Cave Diving and Coin Getting episode. Make sure to stay tuned till the end and check that awesome video out. I, I totally get that on the beach. Yeah, totally yeah. get it on the beach. Now watch, next time we go to the beach, I'm gonna find like somebody's bear bell or something. To... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, here it is. Pull tab. Pull tab. There he is. Ah, there it is. Yep, pull tab. Mm, pin pull pointers. Tab. Pin pointers not finding uh, anything. I think today we'll <coughs> count we'll count up the pull tabs when we're done. Okay. Uh, chasing pull tabs probably. Called it. Chasing pull tabs. Well, that's a nice one. Yeah. Pull tab this time. Uh, almost dropped it. Stubborn, doesn't want to move. There we go. Pop can style. There he is. See how beautiful that pull tab is? Pull tab. Oh, you are leading uh, the pull tab. Or... Uh, I'm pulling them today. Another pull tab. Yep. Yeah. I mean, one of those days. It's an easy hike up here. So, this is what you expect. Pull tab. Pull tab. Hmm? Pull tab. Oh. Ooh, what do we got here? Another blade. So, this is a, it's called a, a kama in Japanese. So, they would have a, a stick right here, and this is what they'd use to chop down weeds and stuff. This one isn't that old. You can still see that. This has got the paint on it still right here. Still sharp though. Yeah. It's still really sharp. Yeah. Cool. Cool. Yeah. There's a lot of iron and stuff going on in this little section. Well, that would be it. They were doing some work up here. On what? I don't know because there's really no rhyme or reason for a new nail to be over here. It's all good though. Not what I'm digging for, but check out the color on that bug. It's a beautiful iridescent greenish blue. Oh, lost him. Yeah, there he is. Beautiful color on that thing. Yeah, yeah something's screaming at me right there. Probably tin foil or pull tab, but pull tab, pull tab. Yeah, found one of them old Coke cans. Yeah, that's a super old Coke can. It's still in pretty de decent condition. That might not be a tin yen either. It could be another older coin. Nice. Nice, nice. Oh, I gotta empty out my pocket a little bit so I can get my baggie out. Should be right in this clump right here. It is. Right here. Looks like a piece of a, an old iron tool. 
got a sharp tip on it. It isn't a nail. Okay. Yeah, it looks like it's a tool, piece of a tool. Once again, nailed it. Nice. Another big one. Yeah. Like a big spike style now. Not these tiny little things. <laughs> it's a big one. Pull tab. Another one of those little teeth. Oh. Yeah, I got all, well, right here. Yeah, right in there. I was getting 80s, which yeah. is usually ends up being a can for me. That's what I'm getting too. Like that musket ball I was chasing down. Whatever this is. We're okay. okay. up pretty high, so it could be lead. What would be really cool is if it was silver. <laughs> <laughs> Here's that possible musket ball from earlier. It looks like it, it could be a rifle one. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's pretty large, but. Yeah, it looks like it could be one of the rifle ones. Jeff, musket ball. Yeah. All right, so, so before I pick it up out of the ground, right here, got a musket ball. Awesome. Sweet musket ball. Probably a musket ball as well. That's my guess anyway. Sorry I missed it. The cameraman was taking a break. Oh, that's fine. So this is actually pretty dense and heavy for its size. Oh. And if you look at it, it does look like it's kind of melted and misshapen and reformed so we're thinking it could could possibly be a small piece of a meteorite or something you're the space guy oh my god yeah oh, hey now right, so what's it is meteorite folks could be and we'll clean it up and iron it is a magnetic who's got a magnet got yeah, something interesting over here. Photo and I just see, it's like, a big, heavy nice. piece of... Uh, it isn't <laughs> iron because it rang up really high, so it's a, it's a big, heavy piece of lead. It's like it could have been connected to something with the way the top right there. I have to get it cleaned up when I get home, see if we can make something out of it. Beautiful. Beautiful. You can kind of hear that coming up, huh? Come on, seriously guys, it's a Disney, it's a Disney peach. <laughs> Lovely, a little bit of, yeah, Disney. Hey, we found something. <laughs>
Kane You got a Kane? Yeah. Square hole. Oh, nice. Square in the hole. Nice. We're about to find one of those today. I might have actually chipped the edge of it off there yeah, when did. I was digging. Nice. Oh, that's a good one. Nice. So finally. Yeah. Look at my hole. <laughs> Nice. About time we pulled an old coin today. Yeah, it's, it's been a few weeks. It's been like a month when we haven't found well, one. Well, it's been a month since I've been out. Yeah. Well, it was a good day overall. Yeah, I mean, lots of pull taps, but yeah. I did pull I did pull out a couple of good finds. Yeah, you got you got the real coin of the day. Got the real coin of the day. And then you got the fishing. Thing. <laughs> I got the fishing sinker on top of a mountain. Yeah. And yeah. and possibly the meteorite. Yeah. I mean, that might that might be the big thing today. Yeah. Nice. So overall, it was a good day. Yeah. Hot. Yep. Very hot. So should we call it a day? I think we should call it a day. Okay. It's a day. Okay. Yeah. If you like what you saw, then detect that subscribe, pinpoint that like, and dig that bell. And we'll see you again on Japan Treasure Hunter's Path to Forgotten History.